Everyone knows what a compact disc is, but have you ever wondered what makes it work? A CD, like a good cake, is made up of layers. First, you start with an injection molded piece of clear polycarbonate plastic. This is then engraved with a series of bumps. Then, apply a reflective aluminium coating before adding an acrylic layer for protection. And finally, stick on a label. But how does this work? Well, the computer reads the engraved bumps by beginning at the center of the CD and following them along as they spiral out in a line that's just half a micrometer wide. And that's really tiny. Just say that this dot were a meter, then these 100 dots would be centimeters, these 10 dots, millimeters, and these 1,000 dots, micrometers. Split that in half, and you've got yourself the width of the CD's bumpy spiral. If you're still not convinced, that's 200 times smaller than the average human hair. And the spiral is so tightly packed that if it were stretched out in a straight line, it would run for nearly five kilometers. But how does the computer read these tiny bumps? Well, it does so by shining an equally fun-sized laser towards them. The light from the laser hits the spiral, and depending whether it strikes a bump or a flat, reflects off the aluminum surface in a different direction. Your computer reads these reflections as either ones or zeros, and that's a language it can understand.